Hello and welcome back to the Marvelous Universe. It's time for the fourth round of qualifiers. We start with Division 4, a hotly contested division between Crimson Centurions and Solar Flares, who are both on top. One of those teams will move past the other if they perform well in the block push, speed skating and balancing. Trust me, this is going to be a good one. First up is the block push. Team Orc will get started off, followed by the Icebreakers. The record still there from the beginning of the year, 148 centimeters. Could be broken. Teams are getting a lot closer to it as we move through the year. Team Orca first going well, actually. Three marbles making it in. One making it out a little bit early, but that was a good push from Team Orca. We'll see what they got. 100.4. Not in the realms of great, but definitely not shabby either. Icebreakers now. And it's not as good a showing for Icebreakers. Two of their marbles falling out of the lane one, making it two lanes over. Barely making it past first set of rest. 67.0. Now that is terrible from Icebreakers, but Tangerine Twists, they shouldn't be able to finish last, yet they give it a go. Tangerine Twist with a pretty much awful push there, very similar to Icebreakers. Yeah, 64.9, very, very, very bad from the Tangerine Twist. Crimson Centurions, however, we'll see how they do. And oh my lord, it is absolutely huge. They push it right off of the track. It's a new record, 166.0. That is huge, obliterating the previous record by 18 centimeters. Look at that, off the track. That is the first record in Division 4. Banana Splits a lot to answer for, and they try to. Look at Banana Splits going through that track with ease there. Three staying in. But wow, 129.3, very nice from Banana Splits, but 166 from the Centurions. Very good. Solar Flares now. We're on a high, and the Solar Flare will almost make it off the track as well. That is big from the solar flares. That got to be close to the old record. Four millimeters off for 147.6. That is rank three now. Gobstoppers, we'll see what they can do. And it's another big one. Division four taking this event by storm today. Big by Gobstoppers, one making it out of the lane, 138.2. That is the eighth best team of all time. The ever increasing standard in this event is fascinating. Snowdrops bring us back down to earth a little bit there. Two staying in, but a very good run for actually only two staying in the lane. 93.2, not bad from Snowdrops. But the winner of this event, of course, the new record holders with 29 points, Crimson Centurions. Leaps and bounds ahead of the rest of the world. Emerald Eagles now rank number two. So Crimson Centurions now with a huge lead over Solar Flares after being level on points with them. 79.5 for them, 57.5 for Solar Flares. Wow. Now we head into speed skating. Team Orca in Heat 1 hold this record, 4.853. We'll see if they can get close to that today. They didn't do too well last time, but we'll see what they can do. Heat 1, Solar Flares, Icebreakers, Team Orca and Gobstoppers. Snowdrops off to good stop, Team Orca coming through near the end there. 5.011 for Team Orca, showing why they are the record holders, why they are the best. Team Orca, Gobstoppers, Icebreakers, and then Solar Flares. Heat 2, Snowdrops, Banana Splits, Centurions, and Tangerine Twists. Banana Splits off to a very good start going through, but the Crimson Centurions and Tangerine Twist just sneaking through at the very end. That last section of this track can change the order completely. 5.043, Centurions close behind, and then followed by Snowdrops, and who we thought we were going to win, Banana Splits in last place. Team Orca win this event overall, however. We see three top 10s there. Tangerine Twist, Crimson Centurions, and Gobstoppers making it into the top 10. Very nice from the Crimson Centurions, though, as they keep their lead there. 27 points ahead. That is huge. Solar Flares still just behind Team Orca, picking up their second win so far. Balancing now. Record in this, of course, is Team Atlantis on 36. No one has beaten that. No one's got close to it for a while. Team Orca will get us started, though. Coming down two at the front, two at the back. One making it to the very end. But three going out a little bit early there. Two, three, and three. Not great from Team Orca. 18. Easy to beat for the other teams. There's an extra 22 points after that they, they can get. Banana Splits now. Team number two. Three going out very quickly. And the one at the back taking it nice and calm. Getting to the very end. Giving those points. Much needed. Much needed points for that team there. 23 for Banana Splits. Very nice indeed. So they are currently in the lead. Crimson Centurions currently on a high. We'll see what they can do. It's not great. We'll make it to the eights. Barely making it to the eights. That is almost going off into the seven. But we see a 4-3 and a 2 for 17. It seems that they've used all their energy in the block push earlier. Gobstoppers now. 
Coming down one out very early. Oh, and it just it got wiped out there. All the whole team out before midway up the track. 11 points for Gobstoppers. 2-2-3 two, two, and 4. Solar Flares now. Team at number 5. Going down very nicely. One making it to the end. One to the 4. And 2 going out very early. The trend we've seen so far. We do want more teams to get higher scores though. We haven't seen anyone really challenging the record in recent weeks. Snowdrops now. Coming down very close together. Almost worked a little bit. One of them got to the very end. One of them into the six. That's a good foundation to set. Although the other two let them down a little bit. Only giving them 20 points overall. Tangerine, Tangerine twists. twists. Let's see what they can do. Coming down fast there. See them. But they don't really do too well. Only making it to the five with one of their marbles that is. The other two making it to three. And then a two to round it off for 13. Not very good from the Tangerine Twist. Room for improvement, most definitely. Icebreakers now. Very, very slow coming down here, but one making it to the eight, so maybe slow is better in this event. Who knows? Two, three, and four. 17. Not great from the Icebreakers, but there have been worse. The winner of this event, however, is Banana Splits. No one making the top 10, but Banana Splits taking home the nine points. We've got two cases where the points are split between Solar Flares and Team Orca. Crimson Centurions now leading on 89 points. Solar Flares on 64. Team Orca jumping up to third, 60.5. That's it with Division 4 Qualifier 4. Crimson Centurions have taken a commanding lead with a stunning block push record. We will be posting the full March schedule on our Instagram shortly, which will now have a new event on it, leading up to the summer of Big Marble Sports. For now, please consider subscribing to the channel, like the video, share it with your family and friends. Until next time, thank you for watching and goodbye.